by Riva. Hi kids, welcome to another episode of Game Review by Rika. Today, I'm going to review the Canoe Quest game from Molly of Denali. Looks like Molly's friend will join her in this game. Let's go ahead and start the game. Canoe Quest! Hey everyone! Today I'm visiting a river on the coast of Alaska. That's a long way from my village. I'm going to canoe along the river with Nina and help with her research. I'll record what we find in my notebook. We're collecting different rocks and fossils to help us learn about the river. It's important to respect the land, so I've gotten permission from the local tribal council to collect here. All right, so we will be collecting rocks today. Tap the today. jars to choose two kinds of rocks to collect. Tap the arrow button to see more jars. Let's do the volcanic rocks. Volcanic rocks. Choose one more jar. Let's click to see some more options. Maybe the red rocks. Red rocks! Canoeing is an important part of my culture. I'm so excited to share it with you. Tap to pick your canoe. Tap the check mark when you're ready. I only see one canoe over here. Anyway, let's click on that and press the check mark. Let's canoe and look for rocks for Nina. Tap the river to steer the canoe with your paddles. You can also use the arrows on your keyboard. Let me use my keyboard as I think it will be easier to press. Ooh, look how these leaves are floating down the river. Yes, a river is a body of water that flows downhill and it's always moving. The movement is called a current and it can be fast or slow. So I guess we will keep paddling now until we see something interesting. That looks like a good spot. Let's ram our canoe to the area. Collect all the rocks Nina needs. Tap the black rocks with the holes in them and the red rocks. These black rocks came from volcanoes and have lots of holes in them. The red rocks have a lot of iron in them. That's why they're this color. So from here we just need to collect all the rocks. Just have to click on each one to collect. There is also a frog in this. I will click on it and see what happens. There is a rock behind the frog. Nice collecting! Masicho River. Look what you found! Volcanic rocks and red rocks! Tap or drag to put the rocks in the right jars. What do you notice is different about these rocks? Volcanic rocks are black and came from flowing hot lava. The red rocks get their color from minerals like iron. So for now we just have to sort out the rocks. Shouldn't be too hard to do. Let me go ahead and finish this. It sounds like I am making music. Almost done. Nice sorting. The table shows what we found. Let's read it. We found eight volcanic rocks and three red rocks. That was fun. And we learned about different kinds of rocks. Let's pick two more jars and go canoeing again. Let's do one more Limestone trip and rocks. we will end the game afterward. Jade stones! Let's help Nina find more rocks. So we are back in the canoe and we'll go down the river. Pretty much Look at does how the fast same the water thing. Moves Avoid over running there. into the rocks Spots in the, the river and try to really reach the destination. Are called rapids. They happen on straight parts at the beginning of the river. Like where we are now. So we can use the rapids to make our canoe My go elders faster. My tell me how to read the river. Thanks to them, I can figure out where I am by looking at it. I wonder what would happen if we miss the target. Will it come back? I guess we will never know. That looks like a good place to collect rocks. Collect all the rocks Nina needs. Tap the white rocks and the green jade stones. The white and gray rocks are made of limestone, and they are really soft. Jades are shiny, and usually come in many different shades of green. Terrific! Masicho, Tribal Council, for letting us collect here. 
I guess there is nothing behind the mouth. Look what you found! Limestone rocks and jade stones. What do you notice is different about these rocks? Limestone rocks are white. Jades are shiny and usually green. Let's finish sorting these rocks. Nice sorting! The table shows what we found. Let's read it. We found six limestone rocks and four jade stones. That was fun! I wonder what rocks are in other parts of the river. Let's pick two more jars and go canoeing again. Choose two more jars to fill. Tap the arrow button to see more jars. I think we should end our game play now. Let's go on to the review and see how many stars this will get. Here is my review of the Canoe Quest game. For the fun rating, I am giving it 3 stars. The game is kind of fun to play, and it has a couple of different things to do. The voice acting is great and the overall gameplay is smooth. I didn't have a chance to finish it but I think it will take a long time to collect all the different rocks. For difficulty, just 1 star. The game is not hard to play and you cannot fail to complete a task. It is very simple. For educational value, I am giving it 3 stars. It teaches the player about different types of rocks, and how they are formed. I think this game does great in teaching about the rocks. Overall, I think this game is good and I would recommend it. Thank you for watching and I hope you like my review. Please remember to hit like and subscribe to my channel. I hope to see you soon when you check